When I was young, our dream was to go to the stars. And so we tried, gave our best, and in the end we made it into space. We came here to prove our machines, our courage. We came for the competition and for the vanity. But we weren't ready yet, and the dream faded, it became a nightmare, it became propaganda and lies. But soon, our old dream became a global necessity. We needed resources. We needed more space and more food. We needed a perspective. After years of digging in the dust of Mars, the inventors gave us wings. The hyperdrive. Our ticket to not only Venus or Jupiter, but to Messier, to Andromeda, and to a galaxy we call Alpha One. A galaxy full of bright suns and beautiful planets. A galaxy full of life, a new hope. An alliance of powerful corporations was forged and Project Genesis initiated. The dream returned and we became pioneers again. Arcs full of genetic material reached Alpha One. Their goal, finding a new home for its cargo and to initiate a new genesis for mankind. The best commanders were chosen to lead these starships and like myself, you are one of them. Welcome to the shipbuilding interface. Here you build and upgrade our ship. This is a greenhouse. The concept of cultivating plants on board of our ship is central to the Genesis project. There is no technology known to us that can effectively store or even provide a vital biosphere for the full time of our endeavor. Different life forms also demand different biosphere. The Alpha Quadrant is full of shipwrecks. Our tractor beam module is a fast way to acquire already refined materials. Materials will be directly moved to the ship's storage. No deposit and no refinery required. Welcome to the bridge, Captain. Here you can find the Galaxy Terminal, Hyperdrive Control, and Computer Mainframe. Use the Galaxy Terminal to set travel destinations. Greetings, Commander. You have been sent to Quadrant Alpha-1. The mission is to find a new home for the crew on board of this ship. Expand your ship and explore the galaxy for resources and interesting new life forms. Look out for a suitable planet, a Genesis candidate, and when you are ready, initiate a Genesis. shipwrecks in this area of space. You can gather refined materials with our tractor beam. 
Select space debris at the tractor beam's terminal. Wait for the materials to arrive on the ship. Ready your weapons. Aggressive life forms could emerge from the loot. This is a workshop module. Here, we research and construct weapons and defenses. You can also configure the weapon racks with your favorite selection of weapons. Assign engineers to the workshop in order to speed up research processes. spots on board the ship. Access granted. Different species need different biosphere components to survive. 
collect plants from the planets, and grow them in greenhouses. To compose the right biosphere for your crew, protect your greenhouses from alien threats at all costs. No plants, no life. Assign gardeners and build greenhouses to optimize the biosphere. Processing. Job assigned. Resources collected. In our cloning laboratories, new clones can be created and added to the crew. Thanks to superior genetics advanced technologies, we are also able to combine human DNA with DNA we collect in outer space. This feature gives us the amazing option to create perfectly specialized beings for the Genesis program. or specialize the crew. You must clone new members using the clone laboratories. The better the lab, the more advanced your clones can become. If you find valuable alien DNA, you can enhance the crew further. Collect biomass and alien DNA from dead creatures with your collector. Build a biomass tank and store biomass for your cloning activities. Feel free to experiment with DNA and alien abilities to maximize crew efficiency. In our cloning laboratories, new clones can be created and added to the crew. Thanks to superior genetics advanced technologies, we are also able to combine human DNA with DNA we collect in outer space. This feature gives us the amazing option to create perfectly specialized beings for the Genesis program. This is our hangar module. The hangar is necessary to acquire resources, plants, or other interesting things from planets and shipwrecks. 
You need to assign pilots to operate a hangar. Please use the hangar terminal for additional information. Resource acquired. To increase the size of the ship and to forge weapons, we need to gather resources. In the current quadrant, we have identified more than 300 planets that we can explore and harvest. Select a planet at the hangar terminal. Send the harvester to the planet and wait for its return, or join the expedition. Carrier robots will then move raw material from the hangar to the deposit, and from there, to the refinery. Refined materials will be stored in storage modules. This is our hangar module. The hangar is necessary to acquire resources, resources, or other interesting things from planets and ship wrecks. Please use the hangar terminal for additional information. Harvester destination set. Job assigned.
life form detected. This is the refinery. Raw materials will be enhanced here. This process takes time. To increase refining speed, assign engineers to work in the refinery. Destination Nine, site. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Launch sequence activated.
detected. Detected.
Life form detected. Life form detected. Life form detected. Life form detected. Life form detected. Life form detected. Life form detected. Life form detected. Life form detected. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Launch sequence activated. Life form detected. 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 